Welcome to Tips Verse. Today I'm going to answer to one important question that comes to the minds of every novice authors of fiction. The question is, does an author need to know science to write a science fiction story? Or is it necessary for an author to have detailed knowledge in scientific concepts before penning down a science fiction masterpiece? To answer this question, you gotta know the genres of science fiction if you're planning to write science fiction story. There are two genres of science fiction. One, hard science fiction. What is a hard science fiction? Hard science fiction story is for the nerds who are basically the technical scientific details of all aspects of writing. Related to science, mathematics, physics, engineering, bioscience, computer science, programming, and any complex scientific logic involved in writing a story. It may also cover Euclidean mathematics to Einsteinian physics. You got the point. It is for high octane scientific concepts involved in writing a story. Example of high science fiction is The Ring World, The Martian. I'm pretty sure you've heard of these storybooks, famous storybooks. Now the second genre, what is that? That is soft science fiction or you can say soft sci-fi. Soft sci-fi can be a scientific, apocalyptic, futuristic genre and does not focus too much on the technical and scientific details but focus more on the characters, society, culture, all the basic scientific knowledge is required to write a soft sci-fi story. Examples of soft sci-fi is The Dune. I'm pretty sure you've heard this also. Now, if you're gonna ask me as an author, I would say an author definitely needs to have a basic scientific knowledge in order to be a sci-fi writer. When you are providing a fictional concept of a science, then there has to be an underlying logic to support your fiction. It sounds bizarre. How can both fiction and logic come together? Let me explain with an example. Suppose you are describing a scene where the protagonist is making a free fall from the sky. As per science, he should be racing towards the ground by the gravitational force, which is natural, and not towards the space. You got my point. Now, let's suppose your character is possessing some supernatural power which can help him or her to fly. It can now defy the gravity by the power of wings or whatever supernatural power your character possesses. Now, let's construct the scene. As a sci-fi writer, how will you write the scene? You can write in this way. The protagonist XYZ fell from the sky freely falling towards Earth. As soon as he is reaching towards the ground, he lets his wings pop out or whatever supernatural power he uses and thus saves himself from hitting the ground. That science concept, what is it here? Pulled by the gravitational force towards the earth, that is a scientific concept. Embedded with the fictional concept, what is the fiction concept here? The wings are popping out or the power of defying the gravity, this is also a fictional concept. Now, this clears your confusion, I hope, because this is one basic example by which you can understand how to apply fiction within science. You can also take a real life scientific phenomena and put fiction concept on your writing if you are planning to write a fantasy story. You need to use science in a logical way and fiction concept together, which may seem unrealistic initially, but when you realize the combination of both these elements gives a powerful weightage to your story, then you can make a great sci-fi story so if you like the channel don't forget to subscribe and see you in the next video cheers